and welcome to this week's segment of Pet of the Week. Joining me now is Susan, the President, and Brenda, the Fundraiser and Events Coordinator from Paws and Purrs. Thank you guys so much for being here today and joining me. Yeah. Who do we have here? They are so cute and so well behaved. We have Lydia and Levi. So tell me about them. I know that they are, they're bonded. They're a bonded right? pair. They're just a little over five years old. Um, Levi is um, very laid back, very quiet, and he likes the quiet life okay. style. Lydia, on the other hand, <laughs> is complete opposite, where she has a little attitude. She's a little batty. Um, of course, I can tell just <laughs> by the way she's looking at me right now. <laughs> yep. Um, we do require um, that they have a fenced in yard. Okay. Um, probably no little kids just because they are a little fearful of new people. Um, they just need someone with some patience and time and they'll be fine. And like I said, I mean, Levi's happy just hanging out, getting attention where Lydia's more independent and okay. does her own thing. Okay. I know I can tell Levi's just been sitting there yeah. the entire yeah. time. He's soaking yeah. it up. He's soaking it up. <laughs> um, but I know you guys have an event coming up as well that you wanted to mention. Yes, we are going to have our chili cook-off. It's at the um, United Steel Workers Local 1000 here in Corning, uh, October 15th from 2 to 5. Okay. Um, we're going to have 50-50 or silent auction. Um, it is $5 at the door and $10 to um, be part of the chili cook-off. And you can always give me a call if you'd like to sign up. Okay. Is there anywhere like online people can learn more information about this event? Yes. We have it on our Paws and Purrs Animal site under events. Okay, awesome. All right, well, thank you guys so much for being here today. Yep. And bringing in Lydia and Levi, they are so cute and so well behaved. So if you would like to adopt them, you can do so by calling Paws and Purrs or just the number on your screen or stopping by. 18 News at Noon will return after the break.